Another way you can add interest to your Word document is by using the available auto shapes. Let me shrink this window for a second so you can see the auto shapes options. When I click on the auto shapes button at the bottom of the screen, there are a variety of different shapes that I can choose from. Now if you can't see this option folks, remain calm, go to view, toolbars, and make sure you've checked off the drawing toolbar. Alright, back to choosing our auto shape. Lots of different choices here. I'm going to go for a call out. This is like a text box, but it has a comic book feel to it. I'm going to go for the oval call out. Resize my window. And I'm going to drag and drop where I want my call out to appear. I can always move it later. And now I can click into it and just start typing. Now because this is good old text in Microsoft Word, I can highlight it, change the font size, center it, let's get a better font type here, a good one, oh, a comic strip one, even better. And now, there's my callout ready to go. Now that I've created my callout, I can click on the callout and drag it around to an appropriate location. But you'll notice it is still covering up some of the text behind it. That I can change. Look at this gray border around your callout. Right click on it, go down to Format Auto Shape, click on the tab at the top called Layout. These look familiar. It's the little dog once again. This will change how the text wraps around the shape. I'm going to go for the square option, click OK, and now as I move my call out, the text will wrap around it a little bit more cleanly. One other great feature that you can find when you right click and go to Format Auto Shape will bounce back to the Colors and Lines tab. You can change the color of the line, the style of the line, and also in the area called weight, how thick it is, or you can choose it from the style dropdown. Now we'll click OK, and you can see that I have changed the outline of my callout. Last trick, folks, watch closely. I'm going to put the pointer on this yellow triangle that's at the bottom of the callout, yellow diamond, drag it so that the callout is next to my speaker, and now my callout is ready to go.